What's up, YouTube? Back with another Beers and Bars video. I'm Casey. It's Court. And today we're acting to Call Us Part 4. Fire in the booth. Fire in that yep. booth. Yo, you guys have been going crazy <laughs> over this one, trying to tell yeah. us to skip Part 2 and 3, man. and I'm glad we didn't. Yep, uh, because that shit was a build-up. That, that shit was a build-up, build man. But now we're going to so, get into it. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Let's we got a fresh it. beer, and we're ready to go. Let's go. Hmm. Whoa, wait, what did he say? You're easily offended. What? Nah, it's just like oh, that. Oh, strong shit. language. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Noted. <it. laughs> it's just another I video. I know yeah. you're going to dig this. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. You ready, cuz? Always, bro. Always, always. Woo. I shoot. So I'm missing him with the dreads now. This is him okay. with the dreads. Yeah. So uh, almost current day, I guess. Yeah, it's probably yeah. much more recent than the last yeah. one. The first one, I was like, I was looking back on our video, uh -huh. and I'm like, yeah, there's probably a good amount of time in between mm -hmm. these two. So Yeah. Or these four. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna dig this. Oh, uh, yeah. Perfect. You ready, cuz? Always, bro. Always, always. You know what time is when you hear this, right? Uh, let's hmm. get ready to rumble. Dun, 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 dun. Yo. Here we go. Listen. 10 year anniversary. Mm. Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. so there it is. All he right. answered it yeah. for us. Okay. 10 years. Thanks. 10 years fire in the booth. Thanks, Thanks to Carla. He still <laughs> owns this booth. Yeah. Carla. <laughs> See, my name's still stitched up on the wall. You hear the beat? Turn up! Turn up! Turn up. Uncle Akala, the flow farter. You already know that I'm smarter than all for the dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't know that beat? Designer Panda? Dun, dun. Oh, I love this beat. Oh, man. He's about to spaz on this. <laughs> oh, man. I love this beat. Okay. Wait, wait. Is this not... Turn up, turn up. Yeah, Uncle Akala, the flow father. You already know that I'm smarter than half of the darker the shit get harder. I spit yet fools when I act like they can't get a quick death. How many careers have been ended in a time that I've only ascended? Just telling things how they are now. Why would the truth be offensive? I was independent when everybody signed. Still independent, respect my grind. Own my own masters. Know what that mean? Understand back catalog. Are you green? Seen? Damn man, he's coming out quick. Yeah man, he's in hard fast. Yeah dude, and then also bring up the fact that yeah. Ten years later, Masters is his own. He owns all of his music. Right. And this is a smart ass dude. And how man. many people, how many rappers have died, heard their careers have died yeah. as, uh -huh. on his ascent? Yeah, that's yeah. right, man. That's whoo -hoo -hoo. man, dude mm. is fire. Just telling things how they are now. Why would the truth be offensive? I was independent when everybody signed. Still independent, respect my grind. Own my own masters. Know what that mean? Understand back catalog. Are you green? Seen means that my kids have a pension. I ain't got kids. Just thought I would mention. See my intention. Ooh. Mangle a mention. Murder a syllable and strangle a sentence. Stand to attention. Ooh. All of your henchmen still couldn't bench him because he's too heavyweight wrenching. Damn. Ooh. All of your All henchmen, henchmen still, still couldn't, couldn't bench him because he's too because heavyweight. He's too heavyweight. Ah, dude. Man. Yeah, oh man, we are in for a treat. And strangle a sentence, stand to attention. All of your henchmen still couldn't bench him because he's too heavyweight, regin. Like old school jungle selection, come through humble a veteran. Ten years since the first album, ten years no daytime radio, ten years still touring. That's real supporters. We all know why they don't play me though. I'm that rapper, rap about matters that actually matter. Challenging power, what? Every single tour is 10% more now. Why do you think that happens? Content matters, albums matter. Man. Uh, yes, speak on it, speak on it, speak Dang, on it, speak on it, speak on it. Man. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there, man. Dude, you know, yes. no radio play or nothing like that, man, but still, you cannot silence the truth, man. Dude. See, when the truth comes at you, man, you know what? People listen. People will listen to that shit. When he already and said it, it will get noticed. And that's why that man touring, that's why that man out doing his thing, man. Well, and you already saw it at the beginning. He was mm -hmm. like, why would the truth offend you? Yeah. It's like, right? Like, straight mm -hmm. coming out the gate. Like, oh, mm -hmm. man, I call it. You the one. Mm -hmm. Power, what? Every single tour is 10% more now. Why do you think that happens? Content matters, albums matter, songs they matter, lyrics they matter, integrity matters, flows it matter. It's worth the skill, but we deal with the matter. No industry hype. Just write what I like. It's a Steve B call with a mic. This I am Mike. Ooh. I am Mike. What I like, cause the fight is a roll of the dice, like rolling on knives. Yeah. Organs openly sliced, cold. I told you the price. Cold in the ice, nah, cold in the life. Living in the war zone, hold my advice. Oh, Ooh. man. Damn it. Damn, Damn it. man, colder than ice. No, colder than mm. ice. Oh man, yeah, the whole Steve Biko <laughs> lines, and then you know the Mike. You know, like the freaking um, MJ line yeah, and stuff MJ's like that, man. Yeah, coming into you, like, yeah. Oh, man. Dude, is ice cold. I told you the price. Cold in the ice. Nah, cold in the life. Living in the war zone. Hold my advice. Take shortcuts. Get cut short. Long road, hard road, but more short. Well toward. I'm doing it at the end of the year. Yeah. Long, ho oh, man. Long, Long road, hard road. road. Yeah. But if you take mature. shortcuts, yeah. if you take shortcuts, you cut short. Like, you didn't cut short. Like, because you, you were not going to, like, get 
the full like thing out of it, right? Like mm-hmm. you're not gonna get what like life should have been giving you if you're trying to take shortcuts. You ain't gonna get what man. you need. Man, I tell you what, dude. Um, I was looking in the comments. I think of uh, part two or whatever, right? And they said some old true shit, man. You know, like you know how people are talking about I stay woke or whatever, man. Um, someone said in there, hey. He's not woke. He's awake. He is awake. You know? And like, if you think about it, man, like woke is past tense though. Right. You know, like he was, a, you know, <laughs> yeah, <that's true. laughs> like he that's was true. awake, but hey, hey man, but he is awake. He is here in the present and he is alert. Yes. You he's, know? he's crushing this. He yes. Is awesome. Take shortcuts, get cut short. Long road, hard road, but more short. Well toured, I'm doing it. The end of the year should make all this clear. Some only get visibility. So a silly fool called me a failure. I smiled to myself. These times I was on the plane to Australia. Sold out shows on the other side of the globe. But fools only know what's in front of their nose. So they stun, pose, but they can't sell shows because their music is poo and they got no flow. I know. Dude, I love that. I love that. This fool, I'm just smiling his face because I'm on my way that. to the other side of the globe. Yeah. Like, it was sold out shows. People yeah. only see what's right in front of their nose. Yeah. Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying, man. This dude is seeing beyond. I mean, just like I'm so far beyond like, all of this petty stuff, you know, that people think are important. And right. that's why, look, 10 years later, sold out shows, Australia, whatever, man. Just any old country, man. Like, they knowing him, man. Because, hey, for one, sound travels. Sound travels. Yes. Real good sound travels. I mean, you know we're listening I mean? to it right now. Like, yeah. Right? Like, this, yeah. Fools only know what's in front of their nose so they stun pose but they can't sell shows because their music is poo and they got no flow I know you might be astonished dog shit cannot be polished no matter how you push it on the public son you cannot make them love it son you know how many rappers could pack out a venue in Addis Ababa guess what it was the only one Bob Marley ever did play in Africa you write raps I write history on the page Woo! and quite listen damn <laughs> you write raps I write history damn Dang. That, that alone right there. Oh, man. He's crushing this. Wow. I see why you guys like this one. Because he's he's <laughs> he's like blended like the last three things together, yeah. right? Like, because that first one, he was really on that like, yeah, I'm going to like tell the truth or I'm going to like, I'm going to like expose the game kind of thing, right? right? And the second one was kind of like a little bit of that, a little yeah. bit of like the blended, whatever. The third one was him kind of talking his shit. Yes. And now we're getting yeah. all of it together. Yeah. And I remember how they were saying, look, you got to listen to part two and three, uh, you know, like uh, quite a few times. And we have. Yeah. But damn, I don't think that no matter what you do, nothing's going to prepare you for this type of fire. Right. Yeah. I'm not, I'm you're just, like, I'm like <laughs> you got to listen to this right before it comes up. So you yeah. Can hear it. Like, yeah. No. Maybe I can be ready for a call. Uh, like, this man, is crazy. Come on. Yeah. Son. You know how many rappers could pack out a venue in Addis Ababa, guess what? It was the only one Bob Marley ever did play in Africa. You write raps, I write history on the page. And quite literally an elder statesman to my own generation, an inspiration. Because the flows that I came with is a solo play by Miles Davis. Who don't know is the greatest? So if Charlie tells anybody else, their fire in the roof is the best there's been. Yeah. <laughs> 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 their fire in the booth is the best there's been. Wow. He is, is he, the best that's been man. in the booth for sure. He is killing this. His name should be on the wall. It should be on the wall. It, mm-hmm. it should be on the front of the building. <laughs> Property. Yeah. <of> call. <laughs> so if Charlie tells anybody else that fire in the booth is the best there's been, is he high? Does he lie? Nah, he knows that I'm in my own league. I'm just totally oh, separate. Oh, if oh, you're oh, actually oh, going oh, on the evidence, oh, you want to oh, be a oh, folder, oh. you know what the level is. You want to be a pro, can you roll with the cleverest? Genius, I know it. Kind of like a roadside tug, get a poet. Kind of like a warrior, kind of like a scholar. But I could be an arse, so don't make me show it. Huh? Oh, I like that. He's like, oh, I'm like an, uh, like like an a artist. Warrior, or kind of like, like a, a scholar. Yeah. yeah. He's like, but I can be an ass. Don't make me show it. Like, I'll fuck mm-hmm. you up. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Like a roadside tug, get a poet. Kinda like a warrior, kinda like a scholar. But I could be your arse, so don't make me show it. I know oh, no. certain kind of supporters don't like when I get this mosey. You think that I care? All that show, you don't really know me. See, I'm an arrogant fuck on the mic. I am not humble, I'm only nice in real life. Who wants an MC that does not think that it's shit? <laughs> I'm not humble, I'm only nice in real life. Oh, but man. But if you come up with me against his mic, hey, you done. You done. You done. Fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> 
back on the mic. I am not humble, I'm only nice in real life. Who wants an MC that does not think that a shit that defeats the whole point? Combat sport, this rap stuff. That's why a man gets slapped when he act up. They cannot catch us, they will get backed up. You can feel the energy coming through the shackers. No aggression, the hood's not listening. Cause aggression is what they're living in. So I keep spitting it. Every day I'm spinning them. Call me a caller. There is no sin in them. Nobody similar. Not the same. I rap about life, they rap about chains. Yeah, we all get dough and we all drive mercs. All do festivals, all get work. We don't all lecture but Oxford with a hoodie on. Cause I got no response for their nonsense. Ooh, don't all do education in war zones. I got no response for the dude. Like, Damn. He's like, I rap about like real things. They're rapping <laughs> yeah, about chains. They're rapping he's about like, chains. We're all doing this thing. Who's who's there? Who's there talking at the at the universities? Yeah. Who's doing all that scholar stuff in a mm-hmm. hoodie? Because I don't care what you gotta say. Yeah. Like exactly. I'm doing my thing. Like exactly. Yo, nobody's touching this dude mm-hmm. in the booth. Like mm-hmm. nobody's touching mm-hmm. this dude in the booth. Like mm-hmm. he is awake. Mm-hmm. Don't all yes. lecture at Oxford with a hoodie on Cause I got no response for their nonsense Don't all do education in war zones Man, I shook to go peck them Despite all the big talk, they were not walking mm. Half of the places are stepping Catch me in anyone's hood on my own Kids act like they seen a ghost I'm like, little bro, I'm 32 years old You think I care about a postcode? I'm not invincible yeah. I think it removed from the physical bit if I get murked Probably be political Cause the things that come out of my mouth is a madness I am a rebellious ba- Wait, yeah. it says something like if he gets murked yeah, yeah. So he's saying like he, he was saying like he went back to like the, like mm-hmm. he goes to any hood or goes yeah. to any like place where right? he's like I'm 32. Yeah. I don't care about my postal code. Mm-hmm. He's like, and if I get murked, it was probably by a politician because yes, of what I've exactly. been what have been preaching exactly. and all this stuff, right? Like somebody's exactly. gonna like put him out, like exactly. So it'll be some old freaking freaking scandalous ass shit, man. Right? You know, to where like the powers that be try to like set something like, you know, well, I'm trying to um, set somebody up like that though, you know, and then also probably plant some cocaine in his car or some crap like that, just to, like <laughs> make it, some crack hey, on him. you know, yeah, like Dave Chappelle style. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You know what I mean? Hey, a case closed. <laughs> Open the shut case. <laughs> If I get murked, probably be political Cause the things that come out of my mouth is a madness I am a rebellious bastard With no respect for authority So I don't suggest that you follow me It's true this can all end horribly But I still be the anomaly and entrepreneur I don't Ooh. say it cause it sounds cool I still be the entrepreneur, entrepreneur. Yeah. Yes, that's what I'm talking about that was, that was cool That's what I'm talking about It's true this can all end horribly But I still be the anomaly and entrepreneur I don't say it cause it sounds cool it's actually true. Ain't got a diamond chain, I admit it, but I do got an office with employees in it. Do take youngsters all around the globe, get them paid for the brain and the lyrics while media wanna still paint us like we are just nothing but crooks. Along comes one so cool, it can make it cool to rap about books. And you can think that's sneaky and stupid, but all that show that you're clueless. Cause the global revenue for books every year is like 10 times more than music. Hmm, now I've sold how many books and self published? How does that look? Ooh, Damn. Man. Damn. Okay, you know what? Take some notes here, people who like to flex. This is real flex right here. Right. This is that real flex shit. You know, all those fucking stupid ass fucking blingy blings or just like whatever, like your ice yeah. box or whatever. All that don't mean shit, man. Well, he's spitting his power right now. And it's so, truth, right? Like he's mm-hmm. like, hey, how much do you think music sold last year? Yeah. Now go look how many books sold. Like look yeah, how much exactly. money that brought in. Yeah. Like you ain't touching that. Like exactly. it's not even close. Exactly. And- you know, like, you know someone like him, man, he's so far above all of this petty shit. And just look how happy, how free this dude is because he's mm-hmm. above all of that motherfucking petty ass shit, you know? And man. he said it earlier. He's like, all of us are driving nice cars mm-hmm. and all of us are doing yeah. whatever. Like, huh? it doesn't like matter. I know that he is too, though, you know, but it's just like, shit, it's just something that gets me from point A to point right, B. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's like, if it burned up tomorrow, mm-hmm. whatever. Water off the duck's back. Years like 10 times more than music. Hmm. Now I've sold how many books and self published? How does that look? For those to only respect checks, swear the account and ain't cooking the books, son. And I don't even hmm. think that capitalism should decide how you write a rap on a rhythm. That is the age we're living in, isn't it? It's all about materialism. More important than any paper debt. Do you check for the them? Let's see. Any one of them little tugs right there. He could have been me. He could have been me. He could have been me. 15, I was in chimes and trends. Coliseum way back then, surrounded by big men and the clap of a skin. You know what's being smoked in green, but everybody Turn pretends. Up. These time I kick wool for the hammers. Weed and the girls put a spanner in the matters. Fact of the matter is, lost my discipline. Late night, brethren's whip with a stick in it. He took it from under his dad's mattress. I never grew up with dad. Who's better off? Complicated, I'm undercompensating. Everybody talks roll, I let him fake it. My oldest was organized crime. They lick banks, so I ain't gas when you say you bag grams. Bad man, what's that? Mad man, stop that. They manufacture gas, we just pop that. They import, export, we just shot. Jesus, man. Man, Jesus. Damn. Damn. Man, he is Man. going just Man. in. Like that beat switched and he just went in, yes. right? Like he's like, yep, now it's time to turn yeah. it up. Yeah, like, hey, nobody's even going to touch me. Man, what he is spitting is just so fucking incredible, bro. 
Yeah. Satan, everybody talks roll, I let them fake it. My olders was organized crime, they lick manks. So I ain't gas when you say you bag grams. Bad man, what's that? Mad man, stop that. They manufacture gas, we just pop that. They Perfect. import, export, we just shot that. Hustle ain't saying I knock that. I'm Ooh. just saying we should see it's deliberate. And by now we should all be sick of it. I'm working on ways to get rid of it. Mass incarceration, ridiculous. So I go jail and I chat to the man, them. Fire in the booth, part one, what I rap them. Explain the system. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. He's like, I go over there. He's like, mass incarceration is ridiculous. And he's like, so man. I go to the man i talked to him and i say yeah. go check out fire in the booth basically yeah. like like Damn. because fire in the booth was telling like some man. hard truths about mass yes. incarceration yeah. Yeah, how you pay, like people paying fifty thousand yeah. dollars a year or whatever for mm -hmm. like each inmate for coming from the state and all this stuff like i was like, damn exactly, man. man so damn, damn this man god damn god. Dude. god damn it's like man he has lessons in each of these Fire in the booth sessions, man. Yeah. Like, I, man, I swear to God, man. It's just, dude, it's like all of these can be taken and put in, in a freaking class, like there at fucking Oxford, right. just like whatever. Look, learn this shit, you know, study this shit, <laughs> write a fucking report on this shit. Like, this is fucking education I mean, right there, man. These four together should be put out as like their own EP yeah. and just like drop for everybody to listen exactly. to. Like. Exactly. Exactly. It's deliberate, and by now we should all be sick of it. I'm working on ways to get rid of it. Mass incarceration, ridiculous. So I go jail and I chat to the man, them. Fire in the booth, part one, what I rap them. Explain the system and how it'll trap them. Action more than rap them. Hmm. All my fire in the booths. They have been studied as texts by countless PhDs around the globe. My youth not have some respect. Did you not just See? say that? <laughs> See? See, man? See? 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 See what I'm saying, man? It's just like, dude, like this, man, this dude, it's, man, it, man, he's like a fucking... College professor that raps. He's, I don't know, man. It's just like he, professor it's just raps. on that fucking <laughs> level right there, man. Like, you know what I mean? It's, Dude, he man, is. for real. I heard he got a couple honorary doctorates. Yeah. I think somebody said in the chat, like, mm -hmm. I mean, I hope one of them's in rap. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Part one, what I rap them, explain the system and how it'll trap them, action more than rap them. Hmm. All my fire in the booths. They have been studied as texts by countless PhDs around the globe. My youth not have some respect. And they still bang on the block from Brixton to Brooklyn, Palestine to West Papua. But despite all the personal Woo! comfort, I still feel sick when I think of the massacre. Because the world is fucked. There's enough to go around. But we are ruled back. All of those there goes preach. Man, all those places that he mentioned, man. You know, from um, Palestinian, mm -hmm. you know, to Brooklyn, to just like wherever, man. Like, Shit's dude, bumping his music yeah. and like, he's that's like, what I'm saying, man. It's just like good sound travels, man. You know, legendary sound yeah. travels. You can't stop it, man. You, you cannot stop shit like this, He's on another man. level. <laughs> the massacre, the world is fucked. There's enough to go round. But we are ruled back. There he goes preaching again. A car Stick to the strip. Just stun. Tell him about your whip. Brand new something and sit. How many girls want to walk up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right, man. Uh, he's like, stick to the yeah, strip, right, Akala. Man. Get back hey, to man, it. Hey, get this crystal, son. Yeah, man, come on, man. Like, get the shit, what, man. What about your whip? How many yeah. girls want to sit? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Fuck, there's enough to go round, but we are ruled back. There he goes preaching again. A car stick to the strip, just stun. Tell him about your whip, brand new something and sit. How many girls wanna walk out? Mm. Come on, let's be honest. I was not ugly before this shit. So you can imagine, <laughs> but the brain power you cannot fathom. I mean it truly from the bottom of my heart, though. Please jump on the bandwagon, I've made it. Cool to be conscious again, say thanks, cause I know that you got more sense. I know that you know yourself when you were sat down with your grand and your friends. That's our culture respect for Ooh, I like that. I like that. I know you know yourself when you're sitting down with grandma and your friends. Yes. And you're just being you. Mm -hmm. You ain't trying to fake the fun for Instagram yes, or whatever exactly. else. That's exactly. That's, exactly. See, damn, that's Carla. real shit. Damn, man. Real shit. Damn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's on that preach shit. <laughs> More sense. I know that you know yourself when you were sat down with your grind and your friends. That's our culture. Respect for the oldest. If it's not coke, let me call you a coke kid. No biggie. When I ramp with a car, I'm so silly. I'm like my grand's name, so milly. Ten years first mm -hmm. album, ten years no daytime play. But in October, we're selling out Coco. Come along, learn about a show on the stage. No hype, man, no cup in the mic. Musicians and visuals all mixed right. I like 40 songs squeezed into an hour and a half. His supporters actually oh, no. okay. consistency <laughs> matters. The rest is just package. Imagine these rappers is tragic. Sitting at home. I have to watch me. They're like, I swear it's black magic. Yeah, black Woo! magic. Real. Damn. Damn. Dang, man. Yeah, black magic. I swear I'm watching black magic. This is magic. This yeah. is crazy. Yeah. 
And I like my boy in the fire in the booth, dude. How do you can like yeah. come in and how you finish him? But now the half is a is actually <laughs> shit. Consistency matters. The rest is just package. Imagine these rappers is tragic. Sitting at home, I've had to watch me. They're like, I swear it's black magic. Yeah, black magic. Real tradition of the rappers. I study my craft. You man, them are slackers. Bow in the presence of greatness. Do you only train to rate fakeness? Love that I get is so overwhelming. I don't even see no haters. Yeah, few man have got more status. Which one has more respect? That's what I thought. A car is the one that they still can't get. Cause I'm like Dennis Brown meets DMX. I'm like Shabra and Brooklyn mm. Beck. Running that ah, old school Stratford Rex. I don't know. Do you know Dennis Brown? He's like, I'm Dennis Brown meets DMX. Yeah. Like, I know DMX. I don't know who uh, Dennis Brown is. Comments, man. let us know who Dennis Maybe Brown is. Maybe y'all know. Oh, we're going to have to check one of his songs out because mm-hmm. now I need to know who's, because I can hear the DMX. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I need to hear who this Dennis Brown is. I know. Which dog. one has more respect? My dog. <laughs> That's what I thought. A call is the one that they still can't get. Cause I'm like Dennis Brown meets DMX. I'm like Shabra and Brookie and Thick. Running down old school Stratford Rex. I feel sorry for whoever comes next. That's like running off the Usain Bolt. That's like singing after John Holt. That's like trying to fluff on the Pope. So beyond money, he tries to act broke. We Man, said this, this every single episode. Who's coming next? Who, I don't want to come after a call and fire in the booth. He's like, Look. that's like running after a Usain Bolt, right? Like, you ain't getting That's like swimming after yeah, like I know. Michael Phelps or whatever. I, know like, what? I'm going to say after this, they should just have a freaking ceremony naming this building after Ocala. And everybody who else comes after this should be paying a freaking tax Yeah, in order to rock on that mic right there. Dude. They should all be paying a fucking tax. Nobody should be allowed you know, to rock on the mic. They should be paying a Kala, you know, in order to be freaking rapping on that mic. Only a Kala should be able to pick who raps on the mics he spit on. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's what I'm saying. They should audition for a <laughs> yeah, right yeah, now. You know what I'm saying? They got to audition for this, this shit now. Crazy. <laughs> running down old school Stratford Rex. I feel sorry for whoever comes next. That's like running off the Usain Bolt. That's like singing after John Holt. That's like trying to floss on the Pope. So beyond money, he tries to act broke. I'm like every book written at once. So I got the youth's head fucked like skunk. Little bit of reggae mixed with a bit of punk. And a discipline like never boo this monk. Like at once? What's that? I'm like every book written at once. Is that yes. what I heard? Man, who comes up with that shit? Dude. Dude is snapping, man. Trying to floss on the Pope, so beyond money, he tries to act broke. I'm like every book written at once, so I got the youth's head fucked like skunk. Little bit of reggae mixed with a bit of punk, and a discipline of a Buddhist monk. A little bit of reggae mixing with a punk, a little yeah. bit of Buddhist, with, or what is like something like Buddhist monk, or a little bit of discipline yeah. with a Buddhist monk. Yeah. Damn, man. So I got the youth's head fucked like skunk. Little bit of reggae mixed with a bit of punk. And a discipline of a Buddhist monk. Like how it feels when you come, she comes at the same time. Now you are one. Oh, you swear there's a god when you're done. Even if you. If that was not a bar, oh, I do not man. know what is. I like he just like he slips it in there too. Like all nonchalant. <laughs> like. <laughs> Damn, McCullough. Damn. 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 How it feels when you come, she comes at the same time. Pun intended. Yeah. <laughs> With a bit of punk and a discipline of a Buddhist monk. Like how yeah. it feels when you come, she comes at the same time. Now you are one. Oof, you will swear there's a god when you're done. Even if you know you don't believe in one, son. All of my children have left the building. Charlie can't have them back because I've killed. You need to get your children out the building. Yeah. That shit you just said. <laughs> oh my oh, goodness. Man. Kids, Damn. kids, cover your eyes, plug your ears. <laughs> Close caption. <laughs> <laughs> <You know. laughs> oh shit. How it feels when you come, she comes at the same time, now you are one Oof, you will swear there's a god when you're done Even if you know you don't believe in one Son, all of my children have left the building Charlie can't have them back cause I've killed them If I don't feel them, they ain't real them, fate is still then Just don't deliberate over the ill estate soldier The middleweight roller, didn't we take over Didn't we take over the middleweight roller The ill estate soldier, deliberate over Lines that I rhyme Damn, man Damn, Damn man Damn. Damn What the you gotta hear that again. That was, that was too smooth, man. That was too Wine smooth. Shit. Feel them. They ain't real them. Fate is still then. Just don't deliberate over the ill estate soldier. The middleweight roller. Didn't we take over? Didn't we take over? The middleweight roller. The ill estate soldier. Deliberate over. Lines that I rhyme with a force. So hard it separate your mind from your thoughts. Know that I am inclined to divorce. You little big mouth from the height of your horse. See, it's a sign of the times that we walk. Those that talk sense get a line in chalk. Those that talk shit get a line of support. Right round the block for the minds that they bought for the. That's the face that yes, everybody yes, in the world is yes, making yes, when they listen to yes, Hakala. Yes, like, yes, no. Is this person real? <laughs> <laughs> this dude gets to sit here he's four like, times now and watch this man he's like, kill it. He's like, there's some fucking AI shit going on right now, right in front of me that I don't know. <laughs> no. Damn. It's just like, man, 
Yeah. This dude, this is not humanly possible, bro. This is like it's the f- not. This is like the one of the first times I heard Harry Mack, right? Like when like it just like mind blowing, you're like, what mm-hmm. just happened? Yeah. Know that I am inclined to divorce You little big mouth from the height of your horse See, it's a sign of the times that we walk Those that talk sense, get a line in chalk Those that talk shit, get a line of support Right round the block for the minds that they bought For the dominant philosophy, the legal arm robbery The global monopoly, this fucking up the only planet that we got If I have my way, I'll tell the truth, I let them rock But unfortunately, it's not, fuck off This is so easy, I love this shit, but I'm almost bored I could write one of these every month But to give them a chance, I've only wrote four oh. <laughs> He's staying straight up. I could write one of these every, every freaking month. And he's like, but to give everybody a chance, <laughs> I only wrote four. <laughs> man, I think if he was coming with this shit every month, man, I think that other artists would be like, uh, nah, uh, fire in the booth. Uh, uh, nah. I'm not going there. Uh, yeah, yeah, man, I got some other shit going on, man. I, I can't do, yeah. I can't do fire in the booth this week. No. <laughs> You can't do fire in the booth ever. Yeah, ever. <laughs> Love this shit, but I'm almost bored. I could write one of these every month, but to give them a chance, I've only wrote four core. Man, they're not training. They're not ready for the levels of Shaolin. That's almost an hour of Mars, my dog. None of which is on my albums. And I got six, and I write books and plays and scripts. Still find time to go teach in the mix. Who told you that he's not the shit? Well, a black liar. Still life. write books and scripts Dang. and still have time to go teach? Yes. In the- <sighs> yes. Hmm. I got, what did he say, six albums? He's like, I did yeah. four of these, got six albums, yeah. I write books and, and then, scripts. Yeah. yeah, dude, like. And then he teaches. And then he teaches. No, I mean, dude, this is, man, this is what you call a fulfilled life right here, man. This is what you this, call, yeah, just number one. Like, yeah, just, Still find time to go teach in the mix Who told you that he's not the shit? Well, a bloody liar he is I want this, this little idiot Try chat to me and you know me can't feel it Why try small me, your eye them tall it Too damn big for your belly Not on your nelly, not on your life Could you find one to touch him on the mic? Yeah, right Imagine a famous rapper from the States Barring for ten minutes straight With the bloody cheek to do it double time Every time, how much piss does he take? Knows that he's great, knows that you're fake Knows that he won't have a bar from your mate Knows that you're late, look at the anticipation Dang, man He's calling you out, American rappers. He's calling you out. <laughs> he said, like, imagine an American America. rapper coming up in this booth doing this thing 10 minutes straight, double timing Damn. it every time. Like, Damn. Where are they at? Damn. Comments, let me know. Who crickets, in America can do this? Crickets, crickets right yeah, now. Yeah, I want to know. Crickets, I want to know. Crickets, Who's got it like this? There's, crickets, there's only crickets, a couple people. Crickets. I think we saw what? King Lowe's did 10 minutes? Yeah. Uh-huh. A couple others? Yeah. Not nonstop, usually? Yeah. I don't know. I remember... Yeah, so we had King Los, we had Black Thought that did it, you know, that long too as yeah, well. Yeah, okay. But it's, but it's, you know, but that's <laughs> like a like few. Th- yeah. Yeah. And, uh-huh. and it wasn't like spit like this. But they, but this dude. This is crazy, this dude, man. This dude. Because there's some people that spit for 10 minutes, but they don't do it like on like some real I shit. Mean, just like that type of energetic, you know. Yeah. I mean, just like that type of energy. And like I don't know how he with, man. because he clearly wrote most of this, but I don't know how he can remember like remember this. Yeah, no, this is like freak, dude. It's crazy. Just, like how freaking I mean, just enthusiastic this whole thing is. I mean, just how energetic it is, man. Right. You know what I mean? That's just. He's crazy, dude. He's hmm. crazy. Knows that he's great. Knows that you're fake. Knows that he won't have a bar from your mate. Knows that you're late. Look at the anticipate every word that I say when I speak. Cause it's the knowledge of Timbuktu. Mixed with the slang of a London you. Added in a heart. Uh, so yeah, man. Like Timbuktu. Mixed yeah. with the... Uh, uh, yeah, I missed the, 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 what came after Timbuktu. The knowledge of Timbuktu. Mixed with the slang of a London you. A, lung, a London you. Mixed with the slang of a London you. Yeah. You know what I think, man? I, you know, I think some of the um, subtitles They're definitely might off. be off because I'm thinking that I'm hearing London Jew. That's what I thought I heard yeah. too, but uh-huh. maybe maybe, maybe. Google correct is yeah. being nice. Gotcha. <laughs> Pay every gotcha. word that I say when I speak because it's the knowledge of Timbuktu mixed with the slang of a London you. Add it in a heart and a soul of the blues, my youth. Now, how can I not go true? Half of a cracker plus half of a coon. Half of a chunk plus half of a coon. Contains more con- was that wait wait that, this is this is number four right here like this is mic number four was the, wait wait so is the mic crackling or was my headphones crackling i don't know that could be the mic man was, was it crackling for you yeah okay so there was that i thought my yeah. headphones came unplugged yeah, i'm man. trying to plug them back in yeah man he about to freaking lay another mic to rest 
<laughs> right now. Contains more content than every single thing you'd ever do. Gassing is easy, but only a few could spit content and still slew. I'm sure you know it's this true, true. One of them is not you. You what? You wanna have a barn? <laughs> with the magic mount, the machine gun armies. With the only one that is channeling Marley. You watch Dude, we are going. Yeah. He's like just flipping yeah. beat to beat to beat to beat. Yeah, like and just, it's just, yeah, he's just like, no, I don't care. Just bring whatever you can. At and he's me, the only one channeling and Marley. I am just going to kill it. Yeah. Content and still slew. I'm sure you know it's this true, true. One of them is not you. You what? You wanna have a Barney with the magic mount, the machine gun armies, with the only one that is channeling Marley. You watch rappers while I'm stuck. Mm. You wanna have a Barney. Barney? Is that like a like a, a UK slang for like you wanna yeah. have a fight or you want some beef that's or like something? Wondering. That's kind of what it sounds you like. You know what? Well, well, I heard something once. You know about Barney. You know that whole tie-in. You know, the whole Barney Rubbo, you know, trouble. I'm like, it's kind of like. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. I've it's, never heard that. That's like, yeah. Uh -huh. But that, that's what it is. That's clever. Yep. Uh -huh. It's like if they try to fuck around with a collar, they'll be in Barney. Rubble. Uh, Trouble. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. The Flintstones bars. Okay. When I have a Barney with the magic mount, the machine gun armies, with the only one that is channeling Marley. You watch rappers while I'm studying Garvey. Left that. We can all see it. You watching rappers while I'm studying, studying Garvey. Garvey? Man. With the only one that is channeling Marley. You watch rappers while I'm studying Garvey. Left that. We can all see who's the best that you came for. Connect for. I came for a chess match. Not the same league, even the same sport. Literally hundreds of stamps in the passport. Not the same. You came for Connect Four. I I'm came for a chess match. match. You didn't even play the same game. A man's game. You don't even play the same game as me. Yeah. I'm playing the thinker of thinkers type of game. Before I came for a chess match, not the same league, even the same sport, literally hundreds of stamps in the passport. Not the same league, even the same sport, literally hundreds of stamps in the passport. And I ain't this black women to make my living, so who's more successful than him? Yeah, I got love in my heart, but it's not all peace and love. Nah, nah, are you kidding? Yes, there were things worth killing and dying for. Ends ain't one of them, though. What are you lying for? Now, if a man runs in your house, mm, what is not dying there's for? There's one thing that's worth, you know, there's some things that are worth, worth killing, killing and dying, dying for, right. but ends aren't one of them. And like I think that he's talking about ends, like as far as like ends meet, you know, just like dough, money. Oh, you know, okay. that's not gotcha, worth dying gotcha. for. Ends, okay, that makes sense. And then like all that stuff, like how he was talking about, you know, he has like over like 100 stamps in his passport, mm -hmm. and you know, he's, he's not. I mean, people, just, just, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wasn't it, was, yeah. It, was it part three or part two when he talks about like yeah. going? I think it was that going to like visit other people and telling your story mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes, there were things worth killing and dying for. Ends ain't one of them, though. What are you lying for? Now, if a man runs in your house, Tom's your mom in the side of a mouth. Who in the right mind wouldn't understand why you ended up taking him out? Yes, love is not soft or sorry. Love is so tough it can make your mom catch your body. Love's the only thing worth killing and dying for. That's what I've learned in my time on this earth. Think that I'm wrong? Go to a lifer's wing. Look the man them in the eyes. Done that many times, got one too many rhymes. The London in my lines, a dungeon for these guys. Crush them to the fine a hundred at a time. Must have had the fine, the cusp of what is rhyme. Clutching and I climb up up the level line. Was always at the top, but now they recognize. Dude, this is fucking insane, man. He went to the the death and row ward, basically, or the where people are gonna stay their whole life in jail. He's like talked to them many times. He's like, oh man, like he's oh, like this. But dude. what he was doing while he was sent, just how, just But he he already just, told you, Court, he was gonna be double timing it. So who does he? Who else is gonna get on here for ten minutes and double time every other bar or every other beat? Who? Nobody. Done that many times, got one too many rhymes. The London in my lines, a dungeon for these guys. Crush them to the fine, a hundred at a time. Must have had the fine, the cusp of what is rhyme. Clutching and I climb up, up the level line was always at the top, but now they recognize. Trust that you recline when I go double time. The flow is so ridiculous, I do prophesize. Guys are ill advised to dive into a fight with I and the wicked eye. You will never get a blind. Just Jesus, man. <laughs> he is. He is probably the best freestyler, like with written, that I've ever seen. Like. I'm trying to think of somebody who's beaten this, and I don't think there's anybody touching it. So I'm telling you, after this session is done, they just need to put a padlock on these doors here. Like, no, I mean, like, for real, nobody else should be allowed in that motherfucker without checking with this dude first. Dude, Straight crazy, up. Yeah. Straight up. If he came to, like, LA Leakers, they're just going to shut it down. They're like, nobody's coming after that. Man. It's going to be like numerous spots getting named after a collar. It's going to mm -hmm. be like property of a collar. And then he can be rapping like, yeah, I own property in the States. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I 
I own LA Leaguers. Yeah. I own motherfucking 106. Six, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Breakfast Club and everybody else. Guys, guys are ill to dive into a fight with I and the wicked eye. You will never get blind. <laughs> He's letting the mic rest right now. You are disgusting, man. In case y'all wondering, he's letting the mic rest right now. You need to be locked up, fam. You need to be locked away. Crying against the pen, man. We try. We try. You are disgusting, bro. You are. You are an animal. We try, bro. Every time you come, you blow me away, fam. You used to party with me. You used to pass yourself every time. You know what? Sometimes people come back and they find the booth one as good as the first. You won't keep raising the levels. Every here. Friday booth you've done has been better, bro. No, thank you. Thank you. We're trying. I don't even trying. know where to put that. <laughs> like, where, where do you put something like that? Yeah. Like, you got scales, you, got, you, got, you got levels. From that, that's just, that's somewhere else. You got, Consistency, you, bro. It's, it's over there. Consistency. You hear yeah. that? Consistency, my brother. Consistency. We got, we got, we got respect it's, the It's not even in the atmosphere, man. It's, it's, it's a different league. We're trying it. Evidence is evidence. I think there's been, there's only been a few platforms that's put us all in the same space as MCs and allowed us to be judged. Wow. On our craft and <laughs> not high, hype and marketing and what the record label's spending and all that. That's all good. There's nothing wrong with all of that, but it comes down to this at the end of the day, isn't it? Lyrics, flows, rhymes. At that was disgusting, bro. At the end of bro. the day, he spit, I mean, dude, he just, just, just straight up. He just, just spoke called facts it right how there. it was. At the right? like, end of the day, like, it's about what comes out your mouth and what you putting on that can, motherfucking mic. See, he basically just said, I don't Ooh. care how much money anybody on their label is spending to boost their market or boost their song or put it out there. He's like, at the end of the day, they can all come in this booth. And we'll see who's we'll see who's standing at the end. We try, we try. You know what? I brought something though. Well, because I wanted, I thought, you know what? Even though I knew them, you know, usually I would end it there, but I yeah. thought it's 10 year anniversary, 10 years since the first album, we got all this activity going on. How can we do something on this platform of all platforms? Yeah. To take it to a new space. Mm. So I bought you a present, bruv. You might have okay. heard me. You might have heard me mention it a few times in the in the in the rap. Yep. I, I wrote a graphic novel slash illustrated poem collaboration with an artist called Tokyo Ayama and Troy Edwards. We need and that's for me, yeah. That's for you, bro. Did you sign it for me? You know what? I didn't, but I will do when we come off air. I love that. I brought a copy for you. He a, because I just wanted to give you a copy. It's, nice. that, bro. it's been very good. But also because this next piece I want to share is from that story. So I've written a story. It's a long form rap that we've then illustrated and turned into a graphic novel about the rise and fall of human empires and this particular piece is from a space in the story where the main character we call the knowledge seeker is being born and reborn in sites of conflict all throughout history so for, let's give them a something a bit conceptual a bit different and out of the box as well i'm working with a composer at the moment to turn that into for want of a better word a spoken wow. word opera shout out to paul gladstone reed so this is a piece that i wanted to share on this so he wow. created a story that shows somebody waking up in like different conflicts throughout history. Yes. And he's now turning that into like some sort of composed yes. piece to like go, oh man, this is God, gonna... man. Woo. If he turns that into a piece where, dude, he's putting that into lyrics, putting that all Yo, over. A... He needs to call my boy Dave and get up there. Like what you guys call it live at the Brits. Yeah, get man. up there on live at the Brits with that big ass piano Need that they got Dave out there. Playing on that the, piano, yeah, man. Oh, some man. people on the strings and stuff like that. And this dude needs to tell this story live. Yeah, let's do it. That let's, would be let's, insane because this video is going to be like five. A better hours word, long. a spoken word opera. Shout out to Paul Gladstone Reed. So this is a piece that I wanted to share on this platform of all platforms, just to get us thinking about what the art of rhyming means and what it could be. So you ready for it? I'm ready, bro. You're an animal, man. Let's do it. <laughs> Truth. <laughs> and it seems I was there. Where? Everywhere. Every battle ever fought. Every stab. Every shot. Through the ages of humans, this killing machine. I could feel everything though. It wasn't a dream. I was every soldier that I'd ever fought With a shield and a sword All the blood ever drawn From a dagger or a bayonet An axe that will slay your neck All my gas to clap, only spraying death 
I was in a tank that exploded in the rock. In a drive by gang wall spraying our cars. I was in Nam. You know how they were talking about I was in a tank that's you know that exploded right in Iraq. You know, they're yeah, so the whole freaking subtitle thing or whatever, they said a rock, but it's supposed yeah, to be yeah. Iraq. Iraq, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah the subtitle damn, thing I that, think is just yeah. guessing what he's saying. Yeah. He's trying to like uh -huh. listen but this, and, Oh man, but this is but, just fucking but it's crazy because dude, you already heard him like he's like, Yeah, they got the axe that'll go to yeah. your neck, and then he's like, I was I was there with like every shield and sword, every yeah. like bayonet, every knife, like every dagger, every so, so it's weird, man. It's just like how he's describing the story. It's kind of you know, like in a way, it's like a Groundhog's Day, but but it's like you're not waking up in the same day. It's like you're going from conflict to conflict and everything, man. Right. And dude, this man, the hey. mind of this guy, man. Right. right. Well, and he this, says he says I've been every enemy I've ever faced. So yes. he's like in both shoes, like I'm from yes. both sides. So yes. It's like yeah. In the drive by gang wolves spraying our cars. I was in Nam. Dropping napalm, but it burned my skin. I was in Soviet men. I was in Italian masking Ethiopians. But the bullets only pierced my flesh because I was both of them. Mm. I could feel every single wound of the flesh. I can only imagine, wow. like in like a theater when he's trying to make this, how crazy that would be just, to watch. Just imagine if he was to tour all of Europe just doing this, man. I'm telling you. Like Broadway? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know, just um something to that level or whatever, but yeah, just I'm um, having that symphony behind it all, and oh, man, yeah. just man, just imagine what that vibe would be like, man. Dude, he could, you know what? I think honestly, man, something like this, like if he were to put this out like a play or whatever, this could fucking crush Hamilton. Or well, not even a play, or one of those like animated yeah, artwork yeah. things like they did it on the Dick yeah. Davis piano, but yeah. like in a giant scale. Yeah, that would be uh -huh. super cool too. Like, oh man, yo, yeah. guys, uh -huh. if that, if that nice. exists already, if he's done this already, because I don't know when this came out. Yeah, if this Dude, already exists, you guys got to link that because I want to watch it. Oh yes, definitely. They massacred Ethiopians, but the bullets only pierced my flesh because I was both of them. I could feel every single wound of the flesh. But also the pleasure of causing the death. I was a soldier with a caliphate on a crusade, a killer, using Christ in exactly the same way. I was every woman ever killed in a witch hunt. Or every little girl forced to grow with a split soul. Cause men like to snip clits or zip bits closed. Oh. So their rape feels nice. Could they take my life? I was fighting for liberation, a woman and a general, bringing death to cowards that sold my genitals. One moment, I killed to be freed. I was a money to kill for my greed. Damn, man. Ooh. He is going all over the place. Like in the way he just jumps between like like different person and different vibe, like yeah. the different sides like of each yeah. story and how he's like, I was on a crusade. So mm -hmm. like like it felt great to kill somebody. And then like some other person's like, oh, and after that, like, he's on the other side of that. It's like I'm on you know, like receiving. Yeah, so he's on the receiving side. Or like ah. I was like every witch like coming yeah. up through the witch hunts. Mm -hmm. Or like, right, like, and, like yeah. he's like, I was like every like woman who's been raped right before they were killed and mm -hmm. then, like the vice versa like the rape felt good before i killed them and yep. like all this crazy like, like, like man wow it's just, oh man dude i know man it's just like the whole back and forth man of what you know this soul or this person is experiencing from dream to dream or just like whatever man this is man it's a man for real this is like i said who thinks of this man this yeah it's crazy i killed to be free the next, I was a money to kill for my greed. Tuthmosis the third, Alexander the fake, Caesar, Napoleon, Francis Drake. The arms of the state with armies that are great, but I was also the resistance that's hardly ever praised. I was every indigenous person of America that died trying to protect their homes from a predator. Then a road clad in Roman senator. And every noble that showed you the ways of the treacherous. I was in the Belgian Congo hacking off limbs. In Rwanda, a cancer doing the same thing. I was a Japanese general occupying the Philippines. A Filipino child too young to know what it means. I was at Sharpville, I was just two. My mother with a bullet in her head. And I knew. Barely out of a womb, I played with a wound. 
A new oh. life was a side. Oh. Wow, that's oh my graphic. Goodness. I was not ready for that. Oh Holy my. shit. God. Jeez, man. You were like. The way he he's he's on Dave level telling a story right now. Like painting a picture. Ooh, man. Barely out of a womb, I played with a wound. I knew life was a cycle, she'll be back soon. I was a soldier of a shanty resisting the British. But at the same time, still selling humans to the Dutch. If you're honest with yourself and you look back through human history, you'd see that we're totally fucked. Cause I was that little girl in that church in Alabama. Then the grand was a damn Margaret Sanger. Then I was Paul Warfield, Tibbetts, Jr. Feeling just fine in a B29. I did my job. 100,000 dead. I went home to relax. Then I was every child ever born with deformed limbs Cause there were just pawns on the board to inform kings I saw sharks following ships Intrigued by the trail that comes overboard I saw sharks following the ship I was on I knew then that it couldn't be long We had tried to get free But as if that were wrong We were thrown overboard from the deck of the zone So many bodies that the sharks couldn't finish the flesh It took the waves to administer death Wow, oh my. man He's like, God. yeah, like the slave trade. So like yeah, everybody that's getting so put on a boat, much he's like so many people bloods. are trying to jump over. Yeah. But there's so many people that are just like yeah. bodies just strewn. That the, the sharks couldn't, you up. know, feast on everything. And so, yeah, the waves took him out. The currents took him out. And that, oh man. Jeez, man. This is crazy. Dude, this dude's mind is on another mm -hmm. level. So many bodies that the sharks couldn't finish the flesh. It took the waves to administer death. And I joined the rest at the bottom of the sea. Now, you know counted. what else, man? When you're... Okay, when I was coming up studying this type of history, you know, it was studied that, hey, that everybody made it, like, hey, like they all made it safely off the slave ships or whatever, but nah. There was, no, like, definitely not. hundreds of thousands not. That's of people crazy that talk. was, like, overboard, thrown overboard, pushed overboard, whatever. Man. Tossed was, overboard for, like, yeah. rebelling, anything, yeah. And I joined the rest at the bottom of the sea. The uncounted millions that dreamed to be free. The next minute I was back on a ship. This time as a soldier of the French. Right off the coast of Haiti, we made a gas chamber for African rebels. I couldn't deal with the stench. Then my head was chopped off by one of Dessaline's henchmen. He gave the order for killing all Frenchmen. Then all I could see was pyramids. Can you see? Designed by man's mind, but built by his greed. The pyramids designed by man, but, mm -hmm. but paint, like basically designed for greed. Like, mm -hmm. yep, just like on that freaking dollar dollar bill. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> designed by man's mind, but built by his greed. The strangest pyramids I ever did see. It's not built by stones, but the bones. Families. Woo. Damn. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I think there's oh gonna come. Oh my gosh. There's I need everyone in the shield to make some noise for a car. You are I know. Yeah. I mean, but thank you, bro. Thank you. Crazy, man. I don't know what it is about 2016, but it, it just feels it feels like a hot. Yeah, I can't even lie. I watched some of the other fire in the boost that have been late and having like, whew, imagine whoof. what this dude's doing right I'll now. I'll just say and be honest, wretches in particular. I love nasties before that. Mm. There's a few that I've loved, bashies. A few of the years, there's been a few that I've been like, oof. And then wretches came out this year. I was like, and I told him, I was like, oh, bro, oh, that's a level. So, <laughs> he said, wretch. So you guys have been throwing, telling us to hit up wretch. We're gonna check him out. But so if a call is giving him praise, he's like, I got to step up my game because Wretch is coming in the booth. We now we got to watch Wretch's fire in the booth. Like, you know what? Let, let, let's keep pushing the boundary and hopefully everyone who comes I, I on. Think, I think he's just done that again. I think the boundary <laughs> you know, just been pushed. Like, you know? like that was something else, bro. Yeah, yeah. Like that was. I visualized every single last thing you said there. I hope so. I hope so. Every single last thing that you said was visual, bro. I hope so. Like, I, I, you know what, sometimes I wish there were words to describe people like you, bro. Like, <laughs> There's no words. And that right there, for young bucks watching this, 
is why Carl is here 13 years later. <laughs> and he's still doing what he's doing. He's a successful businessman. That's right. Ownership is key. Everything he has, he owns. Right. <laughs> I salute you, bro. Nothing but respect. You, much, you are an animal. Unbelievable. Absolutely. Yeah. Unbelievable. The same too as well. Slow money always wins the race. And this dude, yeah, he came up kind of slow, independent, but he owns Tortoise in the hair. Just imagine being that free, not answering to anybody. He answers to the freaking person in the mirror. And goddamn, just this, yeah, they were right. This motherfucking. Yo, (laughs) you guys haven't seen part one, part two, or part three? Check it out. Check it out. We'll see you guys next time.